Great here, and we're in Crusader Kings 2, but we are not on House Rashtra... Rashtra Kuta. There we go, I think I can say it. Here's the good news. The good news is, I figured out that some putts, namely me, mounted my microphone backwards. That's why my audio was so horrible. Uh, at least my, uh, my vocals were so horrible for those videos. The downside is, is that I... Uh, recorded quite a number of episodes and didn't figure out my microphone problem until about 13 episodes in and I did not have a save early on to where I could just scrap it all and restart so I'm just ending that one because the cleaning up the audio was just too much of a chore this is obviously much better so let's just start fresh what I've decided to do First off, I decided to change uh, dynasties. I'm switching over to an independent nation of, I know I'm going to mangle this, uh, Meschera, Meschera, meh, don't know. And what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to, since, uh, let's see, I, could, I have the ruler designer, I am going to design a ruler. That way I can at least pronounce the guy's name. And um, we will go from there and see what we can do. So the first off is eth ethnicity. E let's just keep the ethnicity the same for... Eh. I can go female. Oh, well. We'll keep the ethnicity the same. We'll bounce on the randomize button a few times until we get a, uh, a character that we like the look of. Eh. Sheesh. I'm not sure what I like here. That's a stern looking dude, but... Uh, neck. Nope, 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 nope. Visualize. Nah, we're not going to worry about that. I want to make sure, though. Can I have a beard? Yes. I want... Do we have a good goatee in here? Nope, nope. Yeah, I guess this is good enough. Let's go with the coat of arms. Wow. There is a lot to go by. Layout is plain, okay. I'm sensing a theme here. Oh. I like the wolf. The wolf said it is. Okay. And let's change the colors up a bit. There we go. That looks good. And attributes. Now the way that this works, first off, let's name this guy. He's going to be Gray. I bet you're not going to be surprised by the name. Culture, religion, I'm not going to change either of those. Change education trait and the church plotter. So the way that this works is the better you make your character, the older he gets. So if I want a really high diplomacy, see every point it, I put into diplomacy increases his age. Uh, same thing with health and fertility. Uh, if I get a son, can I actually name the son? No. So I don't want to do that. Amateur spotter. Can I change this? No. So let's see. I want him to be. I don't want him to be perfect off the front because then he he won't have a lot of uh, 
years ahead of him. But I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to make him at least a skilled tactician. Let's give him some traits. And the nice thing is, if you give him negative traits, then uh, he also isn't as old. So, I mean, I could go in and give him the, let's see, attractive and genius and quick, the, the hereditary traits that you're always looking for, but I'm not going to do that. Um, let's see. I want to at least, let's see, do, do, do. Impaler? What the? I've never seen this one before. Oh, he's a torturer. I get it. Well, we need at least three random ones. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this. Okay, he's going to be a scholar. Let's go for three traits. I actually have my hand over my eyes, so I don't know where I am. Second one is... He's ugly. Okay. Third one... Is... He's also greedy. Okay. So there's our three traits. So, let's see. I want at least a learning of eight. Um... He's martial. Oh, I can't. Uh, I can't drop my intrigue anymore, or my stewardship, or my diplomacy. Well, let's bump up his martial a bit, and his diplomacy we're going to leave where it is, but his stewardship we're going to bump up a bit there. So he's going to be. Oh, uh, I can't have him that high. Let's let's shoot for an age of uh, thirty-five. So, this is Grey Demiu, High Chief of Manchera. Uh, wait. Culture, religion. And let's start. Uh, I'm going to find the one that I want to turn off. There it is. Shadow Ruti. No. The, the reason that a lot of people turn this off. Armies will try to retreat into friendly or otherwise safe territory. Retreating armies cannot be engaged by enemy forces. Movement speed and morale regain uh, rate is increased for retreating armies. Basically, they run as far away as they can, and they cannot be engaged during that time. Um, a lot of people just find it frustrating because you end up running all over the place, chasing down the armies. So instead, they... Uh, we turn it off, which is the uh, Shattered Retreat was added at one point. This is the, the original behavior. So uh, retreating armies will move into a neighboring county. Makes it a bit easier. But it also makes the combat a little less running around all over the place. There we go. Let's see what he's got. Uh, can I hold? Yeah, we know this part. So, he is Mordovian, no special features. Tribes are settled, but a agrarian can hold... Oh, he's tribal. Okay. Can use prestige to build tribal holdings. Uh, can call tribal government vassals to arms instead of using liege levies. Do not get vassal tax from tribal governments. Dynasties may grow decadent if the religion also allows it. Rulers can raid infidel neighbors for loot. Yes, I love raiding. Finnic paganism is diverse, varying a lot between tribes and regions. It is shamanistic and animist, revering a multitude of gods, including Uku, Kerkele, Ku, and in the east, Mastor Ava, goddess of the earth. Priests can inherit titles, they can marry women may hold temple holdings, okay. Rulers can raid infidel neighbors for loot, yay, more raiding. Uh, concubines, non pagans with low tech, have a very low supply limit, can be reinforced. There is and can exist no religious head. Women can, may hold spy master positions. Good. Infer uh, inferior conversion, and rulers cannot declare holy wars. Good, good, good. So these three lands are 
my nation. Uh, let's take a look. What is the du jour? The du jour, of course, is this direction. Um, let's see. Uh, I want to get back to here. Can I actually uh, turn off du jour? Here we go. Hi, hi, chieftain of Meshchara. I can also edit this if I want. You know what? I, I think I'm going to do that. I can't do the... Oh, I can actually do the counties as well. I'm not going to do that. So, let's see. How do we siege? Okay, lots of pop-ups. Let's take a look. Ugh, we've got nobody in our council. Really? Wow. Do we have anyone available? Yes, we do. Okay. No heir to your dynasty. That's the big one. If I die, I die. Open council positions. New important decision is available. Tons of them, actually. Worship the ancestors. At peace uh, for the sacrifice. Um, okay, we will hold off on that for the time being. Let's see, title loss and succession, of course. Yep, I know, I know. Title loss and succession. Yep, 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 yep. Rulers unmarried. I know that. Pick ambition. Uh, first ambition. is we are actually we need we need a son so let's go for seduction at first gives us intrigue which i'm not great at but we <laughs> gotta do what we can do rulers unmarried let's pick an ambition don't need a war chest see the realm prosper staying in peace for five years yeah let's do the prosper first since grooming an heir is going to take a while. I've got two the two ducal claims, which is good. However, I think both of them are going to be hard to, hard to press because of the size of the nations on either side. Set crown focus. Uh, let's see. Which, which one do I want to set as my crown focus? Yeah, definitely uh, right. Rezan? Sure, why not? There we go. That's my crown focus. And a whole bunch of minor titles are grantable. Good, good, good. Let's sort out the council. Let's go by order of importance. Chancellor Viras. What do you look like? You're definitely going to stay as my chancellor. Marshal. We do not have a lot of people that are good at marshalling. Now I can either go cheap and pick one of those guys, or uh, there's uh, another thing I can do, which is raising or uh, promoting a commander, which I'm going to do. Steward at 12, that's perfectly fine. However, he is uh, a pragmatist. So, and he's malcontent. And that's because he's also uh, craven, honest, He's really good. And the next, the nearest guy, this is probably going to be my, uh, in fact, congratulations, you are my very, uh, diviner. Ha <laughs> ha! Good, good job. Uh, Marshall, we're not worried about. Stuart. At least he will be.
He is a pragmatist. Yeah. We'll give him a seat on the council. And our spy master. We'll put a pin in that because it might end up being my wife. We'll go to the marshal. And for the marshal, let's go to special events. And I want to promote a commander. I lose 25 prestige. I'm going to take a huge prestige hit right at the beginning of the game. And I lose one gold. But I get of Tay. And he is a 12, which is better than any that I had. He is brawny, diligent, craven. Uh, no, I'm not going to have a craven. Let's do this again. Promote. Oh, I can't promote a commander. I can only do it once every so often, I guess. Let's see. Uh, oh, prestige is greater than 25. Oops. Well, it was worth a shot. But I do need to fill that council slot. So, you, sir, are better than nothing. Yep, you are now our marshal, and he's a quarry hound. And like I said, we're going to put a pin in the spy master because it might end up being my wife. Speaking of, chieftain, high chieftain. Ah, so I do have the, the ducal claim, so I won't lose any of these. That's good. Let's see who we can, Who's my heir? Ah, my steward. Okay. First okay of the video. Woohoo! Jeez, everyone hates me. Why does everyone hate me so much? Ugly. That's right. He's ugly. Well, let's look for a genius. We do have a genius. Temperate, cynical, humble, patient, Germanic. Combat modifier because she's genius. She's Norse. She's 22. And we'll accept the marriage. I will take the prestige hit. I, I have to. I just have to. Let's uh, get that marriage to go through. Um, I'm going to respect the people's wealth just to tamp it down that prestige hit that I took. Okay. Time to make babies. Ugly, ugly babies. Okay, what else can we do? Invite noble, present uh, debutante, worship the ancestors. Uh, yeah, this is a sacrifice. I don't have anyone to sacrifice, so I'm not going to worry about it. Uh, do I have any societies that I can join? The cold ones. <laughs> the cold ones believe that a certain people are born with witch's blood, and it is their blessing. To be able to turn to Chernobog, the black gun, oh, Chernobog, to gain power and wealth. They are frowned upon by traditional believers who would rather call them cursed, as they are rumored to sacrifice humans and commit heinous acts in order to achieve their goals. Nice. Uh, the only reason I know about Chernobog is because of uh, American gods. I think Chernobog is in that. He's the, the one I'm picking up. Open council position. Spy master. Okay, my wife is not going to be the spy master, so this guy, uh, who's also a commander, congrats, you are now my spy master. Where'd you go? Chancellor Stewart, spy master. There he is. He's now a pragmatist. Good deal. Uh, 
regent. I need to get this under control. These people are just... That ugly trade is, is just hurting me. So, Venerable Elders, Court Tutor, I'm not worried about. I already have my commanders assigned. I've got weak commanders, whatever. Let's see, where's my regent? Normally I make my regent my wife. Has she not shown up yet? I'm not going to worry about the regent then. Ah. Uh, pick a patron deity, worship ancestors. Where is my... I don't see where I can get a court physician, so I'm not going to worry about that. But let's try to get my court under control. Uh, Cup Arrow, I'm not going to um, hand out champion. I'm going to make the highest marshal. Who's, uh, my marshal is also going to be my champion. So now he only has a negative one on his opinion. Let's see what else. Master of the Blade. Let's go for Marshall again. Spy Master will be the uh, Master of the Blade. So now he likes me a little bit. Master the Bow. Our div uh, diviner, diviner, diviner is going to be the Master of the Bow. So he, now he should like me. Court Tutor, I'm not going to set. Uh, Cupbearer, I wasn't going to set. Court Physician, I cannot set. And Regent. Yeah. We'll hold off on that for the moment. So let's look at our council. We now have two councilmen who are at least slightly on the positive. A third that's on the cusp of the other two who are working on it. Well, we did unpause for a little bit to get the marriage to go through. I'm going to take a short break, and we will continue this next time. Hope you enjoyed today's video, and have fun.